Sonia, Intuitive Empress here. So this is a collective reading for Aquarius. Don't try and force the crown to fit. It may belong to a different king or queen. So only take what resonates and leave the rest for somebody else. Know that sometimes the roles can flip around, so it may be backwards with the person that you're dealing with. So it looks like you're kind of been feeling a bit of poverty mindset. Maybe you've been struggling quite a lot. Someone may have been holding on to you or you're holding on to a situation. But you've got a firm foundation as well underneath you. So maybe you're financially stable. But it's like you're moving away from the situation which has made you kind of feeling quite sad and low. You're doing a lot of hard work on yourself. You're working really hard in your business trying to get your money together. And you are you're beginning a new cycle where you are getting rewarded. And so that's in the past, so maybe this cycle has already begun. So now you are building your world, you're building your new beginning. You are really working hard to, as you're the artist of your world, and other people are looking up to you because you're doing so well. And it looks like that you have spoken some harsh words, or you're going to in the future. It looks like you need to speak your truth to somebody and tell them the truth about the situation. Maybe you've had quite a bit of stuff that you've been holding on to, maybe your throat chakra has been closed up. But you've been focused on kind of like quite a bit of disappointment from the past and you are not really um, looking, you know, because right behind you there's two beautiful cups which are still upright, but you're focused on the lack and disappointment. But you've got this new beginning. Other people see you starting a new job possibly or getting a raise in, in money, finances, and you have, you're also manifesting this new beginning. It's sort of like two messages. Messages about money and then messages about creating. So be careful what you're creating, what you're thinking about, because that's actually what you're bringing in. So you may have a fear about this new beginning and what you might be manifesting. You're not really thinking straight. But the outcome is that you have been juggling a lot. You've been trying to deal with everything, but your ships are coming in. So you've been really doing so much work on yourself, trying to really do everything. And now it's like you're actually getting blessed and things are coming in for you. You could be a feminine energy who's really good with money, or you could have been dealing with a businesswoman. So you're manifesting this new beginning, passionate new beginning. But be careful what you're wishing for, because you could be wishing for this devil situation. So this is something you've been chained to that's not been good for you. But you have this other choice here, because you have two manifesting cards. There's the same card, Page of Wands, so that's a passionate new beginning. So you have a passion, the wand here as well, so it's sort of like choice. This is the choice. Passionate new beginning with love, home and garden, everything you could ever want, or manifesting this devil energy. So you have to cut free of things that are not good for you, things that have been um, chaining you to this situation, something that's really, really been bad for you, or you can choose to manifest this. So you you be the you make the decision, but this is also double confirmation that you are manifesting something and you have to be sure about what it is you're manifesting and to not manifest something that is bad. Be very careful of what you're thinking about, all right? Because you have the choice of happily ever after or something really horrible and kind of addictive and like nasty. Two. So this is you juggling. This is juggling. You know, you're doing everything. Um, you you have to you're moving away from something you're moving away from disappointments and sort of you know conflict but be very careful what you're thinking about you've had this past disappointment and the universe is trying to pass you something new because they've also got this cup there they've got this cup there and this coin there so like you're getting this new beginning from the universe and it's like the end of a situation so it's a new beginning so this is you're really getting, you You have to move away from this disappointment, these disappointments here, where you're sort of focused on that sadness, and you're getting this these rewards, but you have to um, be very careful about what you're thinking about, and you could have been dealing with a Scorpio, or a Virgo, or you could be coming in to meet with a Virgo or a Scorpio. But it's a new beginning anyway, so I'm very happy for you guys, Aquarius. That's all for now. Bye.